Alchemical Records Newsletter by Daniel Warren Hill Published November 18, 2021 November is a busy month, both culturally and musically. Having already touched briefly on Native American Heritage Month and Veterans Day in the previous weeks, this week I'd like to focus on Music Fairness Awareness Month and Hip Hop History Month. Music Fairness Awareness Month provides a platform for an ongoing conversation about inequalities that currently exist in our music industry. To be fair, there are usually some inequalities in every industry, and it is common for those who have already learned how to monetize a system to be a little hesitant to see that system change. In any event, these inequalities in the music industry can be felt on many levels, however, the conversation is typically steered toward outdated legislation, with advocates musicians might be familiar with like sound exchange, broader, IP, intellectual property industry advocates like the Copyright Alliance, or even George Mason University's own CIP too. Other than keeping legislation current, another prevalent issue is one-sided contracts, which is even Rolling Stone asking why aren't they more current? As a music fan, it can feel easy to be removed from the legal or contractual obligations of the artists we love. That's why the most effective thing we can do as fans is to support the artists we love, especially indie artists, by authentically sharing content, attending live and live streaming shows, buying merch and any methods we can imagine beyond simply listening to a track on our favorite streaming platform. In honor of Hip Hop History Month, here are some resources to get started, including a Smithsonian anthology, a history of women in hip hop, an introduction to DC's own hip hop museum, and Culture Vulture's 2021 Top DMV Rappers. Our team is highlighting a number of DC area rappers and hip hop artists regularly that we feel should be considered for any future lists. The history of all genres and the history of the Washington, D.C., Maryland, and Virginia region's contribution to these genres continues to evolve and become more complex. There is so much still to learn, but we are thankful to be able to create content that adds to the available research material, and we are thankful to you for supporting the artists we have the pleasure of sharing with you.